The gorgeous Josephine Kinsella is back for our regular roundup of some special properties on the market. Mike Piro, Real Estates, Open Homes. And good morning. You are looking stunning, as always. Oh, thank you. So what's the theme today? The theme, we look, we thought we'd take the spotlight, the shine away from Auckland and we'd move out to the regions and see what uh, what you can buy if you step away from the city lights and then, um, look to move the family elsewhere. A lot nice. of people are doing that, are they? Escaping the rat race. Escape the rat race. And yeah. why wouldn't you? So let's head to Kitty Kitty first. So we've uh, we've selected Kerry. Kerry Kerry, we've got Honey Hecke Road, um, and it is your typical brick and tile family home here. It is a three bedroom, single level property, uh, short walking distance to schools, and also uh, it may suit retirees, mm. although there is a, nice a pool. pool there, nice for the grandkids. Um, it's short walking distance to Kerry Kerry, and um, you know, just a great investment at five ninety five. You get a lot of value for money. Wow. Very easy care maintenance. Um, Need some uh, modernising, um, but you know, it's a stock standard, good property to invest in. It's such oh. a beautiful part of the country as it well. It is, isn't Just it? Just stunning. It's great township too mm. to live in. Great township. Yeah, and uh, it's got a dishwasher, I noticed that. So <laughs> <laughs> it's a good selling it's point when people thing. are buying houses. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let's head to Mount Monkanui now. So, Denny mm. Hume, and um, this is this is near Bay Park. I don't know um, if you know Mount Monkanui. I know it well, well, actually, yeah. So, um, obviously, Bay Park's quite a sought-after area to um, to move to with families. Great, again, low-maintenance, brick and tile home. Uh, we have three bedrooms, one bathrooms. At 660000 is around about the um, price range on this one. Um, it, it's going to, um, I think this is going to get a lot of interest. It's very new to the market. It's immaculate and uh, it's perfectly positioned near the mount so you've, you've got great accesses to all services around there um, just a good value for money of buying yeah. in the mount and that's a really that area has really come leaps and bounds in recent years hasn't it absolutely um, you've got a lot of people moving from both Auckland and Christchurch there not just downsizing for um, retirees you know um, having as we said before the Auckland pad um, to a smaller unit or apartment and then uh, opening a uh, house there, um, but you've also got a lot of families that are saying, you know what, I actually want more of a lifestyle, yeah. um, mm. so we're heading to the, the environment of the Mount, which yeah. is just, as we all know, sensational beach. Great, oh. great location and really nice temperature as well. So let's move down the country a little bit further to Greytown. Greytown, so I always love visiting Greytown, there's something quite special about the Wairarapa, um, 1.8 acres, I mean who wouldn't oh, nice. like that? I'm not yeah. quite sure if I'd like to um, <gasps> mow the lawns here. No, but get it right weird. on you. Get it right on. <laughs> Weird, because that's all yep. I want to do is get a ride on lawnmower. Yes. My mum's got <laughs> one. Why. They are amazing. <laughs> but what I wanted to showcase is, is look, if you're looking um, to spend uh, around the mid sixes, this is what it gets you in great time. You have wow. this stunning three bedroom, two bathroom property. You've got three car garaging. You've got park like grounds gorgeous timber flooring, you've really got quite a stately home here. You know, there's not a lot to do, um, but you've got certainly lots of ground maintenance yeah, to lots do. of lawns. And we've even got a nice pool to keep, because it's quite warm down um, Greytown this time of year, yeah. so um, you've got a nice pool to relax and enjoy, beautiful <gasps> garden. You know, I can see this type of property as well being quite appealing for somebody that perhaps um, might like a, um, to go down the resource consent of a home business, you know, have some yeah. weddings here. I was just thinking Ticking that, all yeah. the boxes. Nice. How much would you pay for that? you reckon? So around the mid sixes we're looking wow. from that one. Incredible. Yeah. Okay, Christchurch, let's head there. We're going to Aranui. Aranui, so um, Mike's old stomping grounds where he grew up, Netley Place, um, Aranui, it's stock standard, three bedroom, um, a one bathroom home. Uh, it's not a new build, but it's fairly um, close again, uh, brick and tile, uh, two car garaging, and for 370,000, oh. you know, investment, this is just prime real estate in Christchurch. Very good opportunity here to get on the property. Yeah. Later. Well, wow. very nice. And finally, let's head down to Invercargill. Invercargill. Okay, I picked this one purely because where in New Zealand can you find a property for 85000 that gives you a 10% return? 10% return? 10% return. This wow. property is actually uh, it's actually tenanted at the moment and it's currently returning 10% with, wow. with the rent oh, on it. Look at this. It is an all original. It, it, it's scrimmel. So it's, it's not picture perfect. It needs work. Oh. At the moment um, it is tenanted. Um, but it, you know, if you're a tradie or a builder that mm. wants to put a little bit of energy in an Invercargill property, this one we could see um, it going back on the market if you did the right things to it. You know, probably around the, the 120, 125. And, wow. and it's a project sent, coming on. Yeah, central. 
Invercargill. Very central in Invercargill. So prime real estate here at only 85,000. That's incredible. And you're right. I mean, it's, you know, all you need to do is tidy it up a little. You can flip it. It'd be great. Yeah, <laughs> but it, it does take that tradesman to do it. Yeah. Not, obviously, you can't just go. <laughs> not us. <laughs> not, not us. us. That's, that's what you're saying, it's isn't a big, it? It's a big project. <laughs> nice work. Some fantastic homes. Thank you so much, Josephine. Yeah, uh, really looking forward to what you bring us next week.